Hi there and welcome to my channel. So I recently purchased some Born Pretty Carmelian Flakies. So in this video I'll be showing you and swatching these gorgeous flakies. So I purchased three out of the six colours. I got number one, number two and number four. They each come with the eyeshadow applicators. Now from the outside they all look relatively the same but inside they are very very different. So to apply them I'm not going to be using the eyeshadow applicators, I'm going to be using this brush. I like using this brush for glitters, it works really really well. So each pot is 0.2 grams and they all have these protective lids. Number one is this gorgeous ready gold colour, very autumnal I think. But as you can see, 0.2 grams, you do get quite a bit inside really. On to number two and it's this gorgeous purpley colour with hints of green and blue. These flakies fly everywhere when opening and working with them. They really do make quite a bit of a mess. And number four is this gorgeous blue colour with hints of green and purples. They're also very stunning. I'll be putting each of the colours over a black and white pop stick, which is two layers of UV gel colour cured and then a layer of no white top coat. So they're ready to go and I'll be finishing them with the no white top coat at the end. All I'm going to do is pick up some with my brush and just sort of dab and rub into place. With these you can completely cover the nail or you can do what I'm doing and just apply a little bit here and there but either way is absolutely stunning. Number one over black, it's almost like you've got a fire on your nail. You can really see the red and gold tones coming through. I think they look amazing. And I'll just be doing the same with the white. You get quite a different finish over the white, but the, the tones of colour of reds and golds are still coming through and I'll be top coating them all at the end. On to number two and I'll just be repeating the same process. Now I have tried this over a tacky layer as well. I have lost the picture but I do have footage and that's at the end of the video and it works just the same as the no wipe. I think I prefer the tacky layer. You get them to stick better down but they work well over both so it just comes down to your personal preference. I adore number two with its mixed tones of purples, pinks, greens and blues. I like this sideways slash across the nail, it's so pretty. And finally number four, which does look very similar to number two, but I think you get more of a bluey green tone. But as you can see, all three of these are absolutely stunning and the other three that I obviously haven't purchased are just as stunning. And they're so easy to use. I haven't yet played around much with them, only in this video, but I can't wait to try and apply these to my nails. I've also just taken a delivery of a holographic one, not from Born Pretty, but I will be doing a video for that one as well, so watch out for that video, because that one is amazing. So off camera, I've attached them to my stand and I've applied one coat of my glitter top coat. Now this is a top coat that I only use for like glitters and things like that because I hate little glittery flecks in my top coat. And between each of the sticks, I've wiped my brush to make it sort of clean before I dip it back into my pot again. So now I'll be adding my Born Pretty top coat, which is my no wipe one, and I'll be curing that in my lamp for 60 seconds. And this is the one that I was talking about earlier. This is the tacky layer one. And as you can see, there is no difference. I really struggle to see which is one and which is the other, which is why I've marked on them, which is which. But there is no difference. I just think it's a little bit easier because you've got something to stick to with the tacky layer. So I hope you've enjoyed my swatch and review on these Born Pretty Carmelian Flakes. 
If you did, then please give me a thumbs up and I would love it if you could subscribe to my channel as well. And don't forget to come and follow me on Instagram at Glitter Shine Nails. So until next time, happy stamping and bye.